Hello, viewers. I come your way again with greetings. How are you doing? Hope you are getting on. This is strategy and capacity development class by variable is it Benjamin Obiapo. This is the second part of our class, strategy and capacity development class. The last time we discussed capacity. This time around, we are to discuss what is commonly referred to as curriculum vitae, CV. Your CV is a summary of your capacity. You know, one CV gives a, a picture in a nutshell of one's capacity, what one can do, what one is up to. And it, it, it contributes in determining how you are assessed, valued, appreciated, recognized, or having any responsibility assigned to you, especially when it is in all fairness, when the appraiser is objective or objectively conducted, one CV counts, one CV matters. When we look into the scriptures, we will see a character whose CV took to different places. And that character is none other but David. David was a young man who had a great CV and with that CV he became, he was qualified to become the king, second king of Egypt. When we look into the scriptures in 1 Samuel chapter 16, we will see that David appeared or had the privilege of entering the royal palace because of his capacity. When the first king of Israel, Saul, was being troubled and tormented by an evil spirit, the royal officials, the servants of the king, recommended that someone who knows how to play instruments very well be employed or invited to help soothe the king's spiritual torment. And that's how David was located and invited. The Bible says that according to the scripture and with King Saul's approval, he said, find me someone who plays well and bring him here. One of the servants said to Saul, one of Jesse's sons from Bethlehem is a talented harp player. Not only that, he is a brave warrior, a man of war, and has good judgment. He's also a fine-looking young man, and the Lord is with him. This is Joseph's CV presented, and it gave him access into the king's palace. And at the end of the day, the the problem of the king was solved. He became a, pro a problem solver, a solution provider. The king immediately and automatically picked interest in him and requested that David be allowed to remain in the palace. That's how Joseph's journey to royalty started, you know. And again, the Bible says that in 1 Samuel chapter 17, if you read from verse 34, when Goliath was tormenting the Israelites, you know, harassing and intimidating them, the soldiers of Israel or Israeli soldiers were not able to face Goliath, who was leading, leading the Philistine army. He was messing them up until David appeared from nowhere to visit his brothers to ask of their welfare. That's how he picked interest and 
and volunteered to address or handle Goliath. His brothers and the rest of the people around didn't understand Joseph, David, and wanted to shut him up. But he insisted, and on his insistence, he was taken to the king. That is still King Saul. Before the king, he presented his CV, and he, he said to the king, I have been taking care of my father's sheep and goats, he said, and when a lion or a bear comes to seal a lamb from the flock, I go after it with a club and rescue the lamb from its mouth. If the animal turns on me, I catch it by the jaw and club it to death. I have done this to both lions and bears, and I will do it to this pagan Philistine too, for he has defied the armies of the living God. The Lord who rescued me from the claws of the lion and the bear will rescue me from this Philistine. Saul finally consented. All right, go ahead, he said, and may the Lord be with you. You know what happened thereafter? David was able to pull Goliath down. Your CV is a summary of your capacity. You need to know what you are up to. Others around will also need to know what you are up to, what you can do at time. When there is a need, will you be recommended or will you be requested for? Will you be in demand? Will you be among those that will be needed to handle such problems, such emergencies? It is very, very important that each and every one of us develops his capacity, boosts his capacity, and builds his capacity so that at any point in time when there is need, when there is emergency, and a vacancy is created, you will become a relevant and available option.